Are we here? We are, we're here. Right, okay. It, it, I don't know what happened there. It glitched a little bit. Okay, hello everybody. My name is Jatus and you're the viewer. And welcome back to Star Wars Squadrons, the campaign. Uh, in the last uh, episode, we were the Y-Wings. We took out a whole, like, base. And it was awesome. It was my favourite mission so far, so... Imagine the kind of fun let's we carry on. With the Imperials, huh? Or the credits we could make. Ooh. Uh, as your squad leader, I'm going to pretend I didn't just hear that. <laughs> Gunny, you telling me the New Republic couldn't use more intel? And you know war ain't cheap. Actually, that's a good point. I guess once you steal a Star Destroyer, everything Imperial starts to look tempting. You know, we used to be rebels. We turn into a legit Republic, and suddenly we all gotta stay on the straight and narrow. The Commander's lining up a trap for Teresa Carroll. That's not enough of a con for you? <laughs> in the old days, I trick her for everything but a pair of boots to stand in. <laughs> but I guess this'll do. Well, when he's right, he's right. Now, how about we get some actual work done? Yes, yes, Gunny. Yes, 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 sir. <laughs> I mean, yes, lady. Because it's, it's a lady, right? First. Congratulations. Yeah. Because you captured the Star Destroyer Victorum, our mm -hmm. Starhawk prototype has been completed ahead of schedule. Nice. But the Empire does not know that. Uh -huh. They believe it's still under construction. Teresa Carroll will keep hunting Project Starhawk until it's destroyed. And we've been assigned to stop her. So, using that decoy message I sent, we're going to set up an ambush. The false intel stated that you're protecting a shipment of magnite crystals essential to completing the Starhawk. With this okay. bait, we'll draw Teresa and the Overseer deep into the Xavian Abyss, a highly volatile area of space. Here is where we set our trap. Don't worry about the convoy. It's empty and droid piloted. However, that does mean you'll need to clear any obstructions from its path. <clears throat> Vanguard, I want you to defend that convoy with everything you've got. Okay. We need to make this look good. Your destination is this bottleneck. There, the Starhawk will be waiting to disable the Overseer. <laughs> and hopefully, capture Teresa. Nice. Now, it might sound simple, but nothing is simple in the Xavian Abyss. Brace yourselves. Okay, okay. See, the, the rebel missions just sound more exciting. If Lyndon's right, this plan could knock Teresa Carroll off our tail. Sooner the better, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. That last Lyndon's Imperial mission was so boring. That he's put he us in so danger. Yeah. Can't make him focus on the bigger picture while Teresa's still in it. The commander is a smart man, but everyone has someone who can push their buttons. I wonder if we can push hers too. Yeah. We'll give Teresa a harmless convoy to follow. Play this out and see just how far we can lead her. It's all about playing the long game. When the Empire occupied Moncala. I learned how to string Imperials along. If you seem harmless, people underestimate you. I spent a lot of time around Imperials, playing the dumb alien. A bartender, a sweeper, someone safe. Next day, the Rebellion would know everything I'd overheard. It wasn't easy, but I learned to stay patient and wait for opportunities. Remember, the Xavian Abyss is no place for the faint-hearted. And Teresa knows a few tricks of her own. Keep your eyes and ears open, all right? Gotcha. I love him. He's awesome. Like I said, I wish I wanted to see one in real life. More but... than ready. Oh, it's Hera! the crew personally based on their expertise and experience. They've been training for months. That's good. I appreciate your support on this, General. It's a good plan, Lyndon. Just be careful. I know you have a past with the Overseer's Captain. Don't let it cloud your judgment. One moment, General. Sorry. I can't talk right now. Your squadron is waiting. 
Oh, okay, okay, Lyndon. All right, mate. Well, yeah, you're clearly free now. Look, you're not even looking at anything. You know what? You know what, Lyndon? You know what, Lyndon? Screw you. Yeah. Follow Dibby Light and School Clothing. <laughs> yeah. So the boss wants to pull yeah, me feel better. switch on Teresa. I must be rubbing off on him. <laughs> Of course, the key to a good con is selling it, and going into the Xavian Abyss. Well, either you're too naive to know better, or you think it's worth the risk. Like, the risk. say, Fisk. Starhawk from oh, no, the Frisk, even. <laughs> Theresa Carroll's risking the Abyss just for the chance to destroy some Magnite Crystals. The Abyss because of Frisk. For a surprise. Oh! Jeez, I'm kind of excited to see our Starhawk tackle Teresa's flagship. All those engineers work their tails off to get it finished. That's one good thing about this new republic. We're finally punching at the same weight as the Empire. One way or another, this is gonna be a show. Yeah. Grace, 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 Grace. I've heard tales of the Xavian Abyss. They say it's swallowed entire fleets without a trace. Oh God. Sending our brand new Starhawk in there is quite the gamble. Commander Jade must have complete faith in its builders. And in us, of course. We'll be the ones making this room's work, after all. I took the liberty of studying the Starhawk's blueprints. It's not just another capital ship. It's a defense against Imperial fleets. Every spare inch is packed with lasers and munitions. But what really caught my eye was the tractor beam. If I understood the blueprints, the Starhawk's tractor beam is ten times more powerful than that of a Star Destroyer. Oof. It's incredible. The Magnite crystals they use in the Starhawk's tractor beam are quite rare. I think they salvaged a few from the Star Destroyer we captured. My family spent an exorbitant amount of credit sourcing Magnite crystals. It's so gratifying to see them go to a good cause. Let's put our new Starhawk through its paces. Shall we? Yeah, let's do it. Is anyone else to speak to? Anyone else? Anyone else? Anyone else? Anyone want to talk to me? Anyone? No? Alright, let's go. You oh, I can choose what I want. Fighters for this mission. An X wing, Y wing, or A wing. They've all got pros and cons. Check the schematics and let me know what'll suit you. Oh, I want the X wing. 100%. 100%, eh? Hey. X wing is the boy. Now Frisk has got the, the Y Wing on lockdown. So I can trust him. As you can see, has in a second. I wasn't exaggerating about the dangers of the Xavian Abyss. Yeah. Look oh. at that lightning. And we got word that Teresa Carroll has taken the bait. Her flagship overseer is closing in. All right. Good luck, Vanguard. Protect that convoy. And see I you on the you. other side. See you on the other side. Oh, you can feel it, right? Chaos on every side. We don't belong here. I'd hate to see what does. Hey, what happens once the Starhawk disables the Overseer? The same as the Victorum, I expect. Board it, lock its systems, and take the crew prisoner. I don't know, Grace. I can't imagine Teresa Carroll coming along quietly. I hate these clouds. Who knows what's out there? We know what's out there. A Star Destroyer with a captain who wants us dead. Yeah. <laughs> Real helpful. Thanks, Gunny. <laughs> Convoy's droid autopilot ain't smart enough to steer through these asteroids. Then let's blast them a path. Let's go. Wait, look. A Star Destroyer. Or oh, what's left of one. I'd say it's been here a long while. You'd think this would discourage Teresa Carroll. <sighs> to someone like her, that wreckage ain't a warning. It's one more insult. It's 
No stars drawing. It's a Republic ship. Where? Where the fuck are they? I think that other one was stuck as well. Yeah. reached. Oh, that's a nice shot. Oh, and that one. Look how shiny that rock is compared to the Oh, there's the Star Destroyer. Bam, bam. We're worried about copyright. There it is. The Overseer. Finally. We've drawn it in. Nobody panic. This is the plan. Defend the convoy and keep luring the overseer to the ambush point. How could you challenge an Imperial Star Destroyer? Get those asteroids. If the overseer catches the convoy, it's toast. Guess Teresa decided to handle this convoy herself. I got the cold sweat on my neck. Stay focused. I am. I'm very oh, close. That's so intimidating. Right behind me. Trapped with nowhere to go. Launch fighters. Yeah, oh. More Imperial fighters. Check behind. Okay. Focus on the bombers. Focus on the bombers. Enemies locked right on me. Right here and ready to go. Great shot. Get the last of the fighters. The overseer's right in turbo laser range. Try to focus on the ties. The storm will come under the overseer. If we can make it to the bottleneck in time, we will. We just have to push forward. Uh, uh. 
Yes. I don't know where I'm looking. Safe safe safe. There's so many tires. A lot of tires. There's a lot of tires. I can see it, I can see it the other side. Nearly there. Let's get it off our tail then. Fire tractor beam on my mark. We're ready. Vanguard. Withdraw through the bottleneck to a safe position. Okay, let's go. Ah, look at it! You brought this on yourself, Teresa. Now. Go! <laughs> Safety in the store. Oh, we're playing as the Empire now. Oh, are we? Oh, I don't know. Haha! <laughs> we got you now. Transition. <laughs> well, we know the Starhawk works. 
Nice. Toss the overseer around like a loath rat. Good. Lousy Imperials deserve payback with interest. Shall we just build a Death Star and get it over with? Oh, come on, Grace. We're still the good guys. Anyhow, we won, right? Wherever they jumped, no ship's coming back from that. Well, let's hope so. Ah, I got pins and needles in my foot. Ha! Ah, sorry. Ha! Ah. Ah, sorry, guys. Ha! Ah, ah. <laughs> ha! Uh, okay. Uh, fine. That was a cool mission. Boom. Nice. A, a missile protector. Hmm. Must have been something I did wrong there. But yeah. There you are then, guys. That's that mission done. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Uh, if you did, please hit the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, please follow Dabula Hat and Skull Clothing on Instagram as well. That would mean the absolute world to me. Um, merch dropping very, very soon. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. I've been Jack Tesson, you've been the viewer, and may the force be with you, always.